Gemini, hello, welcome. Let's jump right in here and see what's going on with who you're dealing with. What are the true thoughts and feelings and intentions towards you, Gemini? Now, this is for Geminis who are single, okay? So it's not going to resonate with all of you. Excuse me. But for more readings after this, please go ahead and check out my husband's tarot channel at Possess777. And I do offer personal readings. Everything you need to know in the description box below. Thank you, Gemini. All right, Gemini, so I'm going to shuffle all the cards out first, and then I'll tell you what I see here in regards to who this is that you are dealing with, okay? Hold on here. Gemini so it looks like here they start out really pissed off and aggressive and trying to verbally attack you whether it's internally or externally here that's part of their secret plan so they can celebrate okay or do they want to celebrate with you are they your friend I don't know who this is to you I will say they choose to be emotionally connected to you because this person is not over you this might be an ex okay for some of you here Okay, because it's very clear that they're with someone else and they're miserable with who they're with. Okay, so um, they're celebrating that. They want to celebrate with you. They want to party with you. They want to be a friend. I don't know. After that, oh, just kidding. They're completely confused and delusional. They don't know what the hell's going on. Whoever they live with and whatever's going on at home, shit is very unstable. It is all over the place. It is all fake. Okay, whether the home is beautiful or not, the location's wonderful and sunny. Well, um, it's not so sunny indoors, okay? Um, literally with the sun reversed here, so there's Leo. But um, shit's uh, hitting the fan there at home with whoever they live with. And uh, it's all, they just care too much about the image, like people, society, what they think of them here in that sense. Afterwards, I don't know how this relates to you because obviously they're not with you. So I'm like, either they're saying they don't want to work anymore with you or do anything, or they just don't want to go to work and do shit at their job or be productive. Now they're getting really pissed off and aggressive and somehow they find you a threat, okay? Your position, money, wealth, status. They're trying to cut me off. I'm still going to talk. Um, here's the thing. <laughs> they don't like their job, their, their career path. Being, if they are a father figure, mother figure, which I do see right here, you projected really beautifully that they have a baby. For some of you, they don't have to, okay? Um, here's the thing. They're not happy with be, doing any of that. They're not happy with who they're with. They're not happy with anything, okay? They're corrupt. Now they have to be fake and put up a facade and a show and be inauthentic. Looks like it makes them happy. Now, here's the thing. It's because they have emotional commitment to you. They want to be nice to you, kind, loving, 444, all that. Okay, cool. But they're also aware of the toxicity, deception, addiction they have to you. So they're trying to be cool. 
have they messaged you maybe or they want to relay a message or they feel inspired and enlightened i feel like i've said this before they go to you for ideas and information and enlightenment so they can go run back to their channel or business to be enlightened when you're the real enlightened one gemini now they're pissed off and mad and aggressive at you now they don't like you probably because i said what i said now they want to be narcissistic and egotistical and cold and not be faithful, not be trustworthy, not be of faith or hope or anything here. Now they want to be greedy and not even get their hands dirty and put in the hard work and humble their fucking selves. Just kidding. Now they're going to emotionally walk away and disconnect from you because they are in a relationship with someone else, but also because they're emotionally connected to you still. And that's what they're freaking out about. They're trying to figure out how could they invest their time, money, and energy with you. They want to fight for you. Just kidding, now they're, it gets too real, they're confused, they don't know what the fuck to do. Now they're miserable, mad, sad, moody, depressed, unhappy with themselves and unhappy with you because this is all in the workplace. So you guys know each other through literal business, office stuff, your career path, their career path, online, offline. They go to, so here's a few things here. Some of you, they do collaborate with you. You guys work together all the time or every day or whatever. Others of you, they're aware of you based on what you do for work and they go to you to pluck off your ideas. Steal, copy, take, chill, uh, uh, cheat. Maybe they need, they need to chill. Um, what they're doing at their workplace, at their vibe is corrupt as fuck, okay? They're lazy. Right after this, they wanna be more greedy and take, somehow make money off of you. Now they're starting to lose their fucking cool and they're getting aggressive here, but they're trying to still be patient and calm and cool because they know what they put themselves through here in the situation which is they don't want to close the door. You already closed the door on them, okay? They don't want it to be over yet, but it's been done fucking over. And that's why they don't know, do they want to offer something to you? Do they not? Do they just want to go for their own opportunities or do they not? They don't know. They don't know, Gemini. Okay, hold on, I saw some cards here. Flip, where do we go here? I saw it. I saw it. I'm going to find it. I might give you more time because they're trying to waste my time because shit's about to get too real. I can feel it. I saw it. Okay. <laughs> Let me go through one more day. Anyway, they have a crush on you. They have feelings for you still. They want to talk to you, give you a message of love, send you a message of love. And that's something that they're actually not afraid of, which is nice. But what's fucked up is they're with someone else. So there's that. Figure your shit out, cross watcher. Anyway, let's see here. Oh, just kidding. That fast. Now they want to say they hate you. They have no passion for you. They want to be deceptive as fuck towards you. Okay, well, we don't give a shit. Gemini and I don't give a shit. And now they want to brag that, yeah, they do use you for ideas and pluck everything off of you. And they're lazy as fuck. And they're not skilled or good. Well, that's a compliment, Gemini. It's a compliment. Yeah, and I call bullshit on that, but we'll leave it there. Just kidding. It's all to make it equal for everyone in the community. Oh. By stealing from Gemini every damn day? Okay. Anyway, you could be dealing with an air sign, a fire sign, water sign, or earth sign. Thank you. Bye.